In today's video, I'm gonna be playing Honkai Star Rail for the first time and sharing some of my thoughts. All right, we're starting off strong. Got a cutscene that's a classic. I gotta say, this background music sounds so familiar. Like, I swear I played it when I was a little kid or something. Oh, what's the name of that song? This violin lady be looking kind of evil right now. We're starting off immediately with some battle. Use basic attack on selected enemy. Pretty easy battle. Ah, but once you're out of the battle, it's more open world-like, so that's pretty fun. All characters have a powerful ultimate which can be used when their energy is full. Fight enemies to regenerate energy. All right. Honestly, I don't really know what's going on right now, but there are some big glowing buns on my screen telling me to uh, unleash my ultimate, so I guess I'll do that. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. That is some nice animation. <gasps> oh, I like her character design. That's cute. <laughs> This is a lot of reading. I mean, I guess Genshin had a lot of reading too, but this feels like more. Stellaron means cancer of all worlds? As someone whose name is Stella, I'm uh, kind of offended by this. Ooh, okay, Silver Wolf is now on my team. Temporarily. And ah, oh, I freaking love her ponytail. That's so cute. Now let's go, let's go. Characters and, and enemies act in sequence from top to the bottom. So this isn't like Genshin where it's kind of more open world combat-y. It's very, you enter combat and then you start actually fighting. Maybe a little bit like Pokemon, you know, when you meet eye contact with someone, you start the battle. Oh, I guess I changed that recently. Okay, let's use my skill. Damn, the animation looks so good. Ugh. You are at full energy. Activate your ultimate now. After an ultimate becomes available, it can be used immediately. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> Hacker lady. <laughs> That's so funny. Damn. These ultimate animations look so good. They're even better than the Genshin ones. Skill points is a combat resources shared by the whole team. You can switch to skill and then consume skill points to use skill. How do I see how many skill points this costs? I don't know, but whatever. I think right now I'm mostly just clicking buttons. I guess I have no skill points, so I can't use my skill right now. Use basic attack to recover skill points. Fast forward function is not yet available. I'm so impatient. I'm like, speed up those enemy animations, y'all. Let's go, let's go. Battle over. Okay, I'll be honest. I'm kind of a little bit confused about what the heck is going on in the story right now, but the character designs and the animations look good enough that I can forgive it. The receptacle's ready. So basically, this is the choosing whether you're a boy or a girl, huh? Oh my gosh, and the name is Stell? So close, so close. I am Stella. Very close. So I'm made of the Stellaron? Seems kind of appropriate. I don't remember shit right now. I have no idea what's going on in this story, but that's okay. I will encounter all kinds of perils and hardships, but also have many wonderful experiences. Dude, this is the most ambiguous shit I've ever heard. Do you like it? I guess. What is there to like or dislike? It's the most vague stuff ever. As long as you know in your heart where you're heading, you're guaranteed to see the ending of your story. Dude, that's kind of ominous, man. I'm like, uh, mm -mm. Kafka and Silver Wolf definitely feel like they're not good guys right now, but they do have great designs, so. Then again, Mihoyo designed some pretty nice bad characters too. All right, I gotta say, I haven't been super impressed with the storytelling so far, but I can forgive that just because the game looks so pretty. Ah, the classic Mahoyo eyes opening scene. They're treating us to fan service real early, huh? My name is Stella. I am a empty main character with no thoughts or feelings. This is March 7th? What kind of name is that? I mean, I like her design a lot, but that's kind of silly, I gotta say. Who are you guys? Miss Herta. So funny. Miss Herta. Miss Herta. I like the way they say that. 
The Astral Express? It comes here. It's a train that can travel between the stars with the power of the Trailblaze Eon. They sure love fancy words in this game. Detailed information about characters can be viewed in the character stream. I am a physical type character. I follow the path of destruction. That's me. Destructive. It's like March 7th. Oh my god. Why is that her name? It's, it's hilarious, but really? Characters come in different types and follow different paths. March 7th follows the path of preservation. So we got preservation, destruction, the hunt, erudition, harmony, nihility, and abundance. Type icon indicates the enemy's weakness type. White bar, uh, blah, blah, toughness. Using the same attack as their weakness will deplete their toughness. Cool. I remember when I first played Genshin, I was so confused about all Some the elemental stuff. Be. And I imagine that unless if Star Rail uses the same system, I will continue to be confused. But it's okay. I think that's the type of stuff that you pick up on eventually and isn't actually that important for the start. Ooh, her ult is ready. Let's use it. Ooh. Her smile. Oh my gosh. Although I will say that kind of did some puny damage there. On the other hand, I did some massive damage there. Good job, me. Ooh, another big bad. The enemy's weakness has can be viewed after approaching them. Entering that battle with an attack matching their weakness. Okay, cool. So, I don't know. I'm just gonna hit him. Looks like I did it. Good job, me. Stella is locked on by the enemy and will be attacked first. Cool. Cool. <gasps> the power of cuteness! That's so funny. My ult is ready. So let's use it. Oh, I got a big train. I got a big stick. <gasps> That's kind of funny. It's like a lightsaber, I guess. Let's do it. Damn, I just wiped out. Oh, I guess I just wiped out one of them. Oh, yeah, I'm shielded. Oh, I'm doing puny damage right now. Puny damage, puny damage. My ult will do some damage. Oh, so good, so good. Damn. Oh, now it tells me the instructions about my ult. There's two versions, a single target and a blast. Well, there's only one guy left, so let's single target this shit. Good job, me. Good job, me. Gotta go find some other dude. Oh, look at that maple tree. The hunt. We got Danhung. Oh, increase their levels. Level four. Hey, wait a second. Now he's a higher level than March 7th and me. I can't let that be. Yeah, now I'm level four too. Let's go, let's go. Let's go find this guy. All right, let's get it. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Was that a crit? I have no idea. Oh, hello. He's so small! Oh my gosh, he's even smaller than March 7th. Oh, poor boy. Oh my gosh. She loses things. I lose things. March 7th, I, I relate. I relate. Some other mechanic. Traces, don't know what that means. A lot of branches here. Just gonna follow the instructions. Hit activate. Yeah, I'll be honest, I have no idea what this mechanic does, but I'm sure I'll pick it up eventually. Oh, another dude. Oh, I just walked by him. Ha, <laughs> that's kind of funny. So I guess you don't have to fight everyone. You can dodge them. You don't have to initiate combat. Oh, this guy saw me. Is he chasing me? He's chasing me, but I'm ignoring him. Can I keep ignoring him? Turns out you can keep ignoring them. IPC, oh my god. There's so many turns. They're very useful in combat. Well, sounds like I should use them. All right. I don't know what that does, but presumably it probably makes me stronger. Maybe I should have read it, but I'm impatient. Too many words. Equip. Oh, that does not look good. All right. Let's have this guy attack the big dude. Oh, I'm doing no damage. The power of cuteness. It gets me every time. Oh, he's got his ult ready. Let's see it. Oh. 
Oh. Oh, wow, that's pretty. All right, two down, one to go. This guy is a beefy boy. I am doing so little to him. Girl power. I love March 7th's attack names. They're so funny. I wonder if like everyone else also has attack names, but I'm only noticing March 7th's because they're funny. Ah, oh, yeah, Cloud Lancer Art Torrent. Totally didn't even notice that on my screen. Deus Ex Machina. Ooh, that is not looking good for us. Oh, that's Deus Ex Machina. That's someone random saving us out of nowhere. Yeah, this game is so like mecha y. It's, it's kind of odd seeing all the characters, but they're like spears, but also like clearly guns and space lasers. <gasps> Her design is so pretty. Oh my gosh. I love, I love. <laughs> that pose. Am I doing a good job? <laughs> Damn, her dress is so cute too. Wow, I want her. In a gotcha game kind of way, not in a weird way. Himeko has joined the team temporarily. Please, what can I do to make her permanent? Oh my god, these are like little kids? They're researchers? That's kind of strange. Asta! Oh, Asta's cute too. Not as pretty as Himeko though. Oh, but I do like her spacey outfit. Okay, I'm one of those people who hates having all these like exclamation points around, so I'm gonna click on them. Whoa, that's a lot of exclamation points. Speed, speed, let's go. You know, maybe I should be reading these instead of just clicking through them, but I'll do that someday. Got some stuff. We got some more stuff. Oh, we got a new character. Ooh, electricity looking. And you know how it goes. This is a gotcha game. We gotta do the gotcha pulls. I've got 20 of these tickets. And based on my research, I saw that you're supposed to pull on, I believe the beginner banner. So as pretty as this girl is, I will follow their advice and pull on the beginner banner. Let's go. Hopefully I got a five star, but I only have a 20 ticket chance. So we'll see. I wonder if there's any way to tell that you got a five star early. Like in Genshin, they'll do the gold pattern. Okay. I guess these are the like skill books. Mutual Demise. Oh, arrows. <laughs> Data bank. Darting arrow. Adversarial. Collapsing sky. Oh, eyes of the prey. Data bank. All right, well, it looks like the one special thing I got this time was Eyes of the Prey, which is a book with a hot guy on it. All right, one more temple. The anticipation music. Darting arrow. Loop. Passkey. Loop. Adversarial. Arrows. Darting arrow. This is Herta? All right, I did not expect that to be what Herta looked like. She is very pretty, but are those dolls? Kind of creepy. Either way, very stoked to have gotten a character. Herta, oh my God, she's a little girl. That's not what I expected at all. Well, I guess I got the grand reveal of what Herta looks like early. Cool, cool. Let's go play with my new characters. We've already played with you. Let's play with Herta instead. We've already played with you. Let's play with Himeko instead. We've already played with you. Let's try out Serval. Then I guess the fourth person will just be my favorite person. There's already a ice type person, so maybe I'll keep my main character around since, you know, main character or whatever. Ha! Four girls, one boy, perfect gender ratio. Oh, luckily they prevent you from jumping off cliffs. Otherwise, I would have jumped off many cliffs already. 
Oh man, this spaceship looks so good. But it's definitely very different vibes from Genshin. If I didn't already say that 10 times already. Travel log. Oh, okay. Star Rail Special Pass, don't know what that does. A lot of stuff. Oh, you get Herta. Well, I guess that makes it a little bit less exciting that I pulled her. Oh. Ooh, that is not looking good. <laughs> Mr. Yang? My last name is Yang. Dude, this game is all over my name today. All right, let's go, let's go. I'm excited to test out my new battle abilities. Oh my god, Heart just got a hammer? That's so funny. Himi can launch follow-up attacks during battle. Each time an ally inflicts weakness break, Himiko accumulates charge. Huh. Himiko will unleash a charge a follow up attack. Oh, there's the drone. Ew, and Herta does it too? Oh, that was a lot of damage. Maybe I should have a um, healer character. Whoops. Oh well, I guess it worked out. Who needs healers when you can just kill them instead? I'd like to heal, please. Is this not a healing thing? I guess this is not a healing thing. Whoops. I'd like to not fight that dude. Oh man. Okay, I guess I gotta fight that dude. Can I uh, have Himeko go? Oh, ambushed. That's not good. That's not good. All right, let's go. Let's go. Ultimate time. Oh. Oh. Huh. Oh my god. That might be my favorite one so far. That's so funny. And she does mad damage too. Well, let's see her all. Oh, rock, rock. Huh? Oh, that scared me. Oh my god, we have to fight this dude? Thankfully, my HP is back to full, but... Maybe I should have brought a healer with me. Whoops. Oy, not looking so good. I guess I just AoE these guys. Oh, I'm doing puny damage right now. Okay, we're making real progress here. Ooh, Himeko's ult for the first time. <gasps> oh my god, I thought she was gonna step on... Step on something. <laughs> wow, that's fine too. Damn, Himeko did mad damage. What kind of crushing it right now? Anti-matter engine has been broken. Okay, does that make him dead? Oh, never mind. Now the fight actually starts, I understand. Oh, wait, I'm doing so much damage. Himeko's OP. Oh, that was his first HP bar out of how many? Whoa. Oh, I should have brought a healer. <laughs> you know, I'm really hoping that some like Deus Ex Machina shows up because this, this fight is not looking so hot right now. All right, please, Himeko, carry me, carry me. Hurts is dead! Oh, yikes. Am I supposed to win this fight? <gasps> ah, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Okay. Somehow I'm still alive. Impending doom. Oh my god, 4 HP. 5 HP! Yikes! I just gotta go for it. Oh! 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 Only Himeko's left! <gasps> rough! Oh, rough! Please, Himeko, I believe in you! Uh, okay. Dude, I don't know if this is completely doomed, or if I'm supposed to just barely make it. Himeko, Himeko, Himeko! 
Dude, I just barely scraped by. Jesus, that was rough. That was rough. Basically telling me don't commit suicide just yet. Oh. Well, Kimiko certainly was right. I am saving the day right now. Oh. Oh, that's Mr. Yang. That guy looks very condescending right now. Well, I figured that's a good place to stop and get some of my first impressions. Overall, I think it was a solid game. I'm definitely going to keep playing, and I think if you're interested, you should definitely check it out. So my favorite thing about the game is definitely the character design. Mihoyo knocked it out of the park as always, which I guess makes sense because they want to bait us to buying characters and spending money. I thought the combat in the game was pretty solid, even though I'll admit I didn't know what was going on half the time. I do think there are some advantages to having the turn-based combat. One, it's like more friendly if you're on your phone, and I can also totally see a world where like auto-battling is a thing. And also, just because something is turn-based doesn't mean it's not strategic, like I love watching competitive Pokemon, so I'm sure Konkai will have some harder fights where you have to strategize about how your team synergizes, and you know, all the different mechanics that they have. That said, the game is certainly not perfect, and the biggest weakness, in my opinion, is by far the story. I know it probably made no sense to you, because I definitely clipped out parts of it, but honestly, as someone who played the game, it also made no sense to me. And I guess it's because I've never played a Honkai game before, so I don't have any context on the characters, but I just feel like the Genshin writing was a lot better done, especially in the like introduction of the game part. But you know, I think I can forgive it just because everything else in the game is so well done. I'm also curious to see if Honkai is going to have the same open world exploration element as Genshin. So far, I've been pretty confined to a linear path, which might make sense since, you know, it is the very beginning of the game. But the open world part was one of my favorite things in Genshin, and so far I haven't really seen much of it in Honkai. Anyhow, overall, I think Honkai was a pretty solid game. I'm going to keep playing, and I definitely think it's worth checking out if you're interested in giving it a shot. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. It really means the world to me. Hope to see you next time. Bye.